Hi everyone and welcome to Nico's Kitchen's Budget Meals. Today we're going to be making a super cheap breakfast meal and it is so good for you and so tasty. We're making a blueberry trifle with granola. He's got budget meals Monday, what you want Wednesday, fast food Friday, what else could he share? It's Nico's Kitchen where satisfying meals are so the first thing that we're going to do to get started on our blueberry breakfast trifle is make this beautiful crunchy granola to go with it. And just into a bowl here, what I'm going to be adding in first is just some rolled oats. Next up I've got some almonds here that I've just roughly chopped up. Also going to be adding in some sunflower seeds and also some pumpkin seeds or pepitas. Just for a really nice flavour as well. I'm going to be putting in some sesame seeds too. And now for our wet ingredients, I'm going to be putting in some honey as well. And lastly, some sunflower oil. Now we're going to give this a good mix around, get all the nuts combined in with the oil. And we want it not overly wet, but just until those nuts start, start to hold together. So just onto a baking tray here, I'm going to be pouring our nuts over. Now this is going into a preheated oven at about 170 degrees C for 20 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes, just until it starts to go nice and golden brown on the top. Okay, so the next step in our blueberry trifle is to make our blueberry mixture. So just into a saucepan here, I've got no heat, I'm going to be adding in some fresh blueberries. Now if you can't get any fresh ones, frozen ones will be fine as well. To the blueberries, I'm just going to add in just a small amount of sugar. Next I'm going to add a spice and it just goes so well with blueberries and I'm talking about cinnamon. Cinnamon goes really well with this. I'm just going to sprinkle a little bit in and also just a tiny amount of water as well. So I've just turned the heat on to a low medium heat and I'm just going to cook this for about five to seven minutes over that heat just, just until that sugar and the water start to thicken up and those blueberries break down slightly and start to soften. So guys this is what we're after here. You can see here it's nice, it's just thickened up and those blueberries have started to broken down. So we're going to leave this to cool to room temperature now and we're going to wait for our granola to come out and then we can assemble our breakfast trifle. So I've pulled out our granola, I've left it to cool and what I did was just, just before it started to really cool down, I've just scraped it off the tray into sort of large chunks and then put it into the bowl here to cool completely. So our blueberries are done, our granola's done, let's assemble it. So the other ingredient that I'm using to go with this of course is some Greek yogurt, just some plain Greek yogurt and I'm just going to pop some into the bowl and then we've got some of those blueberries I'm just going to pop them in as well. A nice helping of that granola just on the top. And there you have it guys, that is the perfect breakfast. So cool, so fast to do, so easy to do. That is going to taste spectacular. Okay, let's give this blueberry granola trifle a go, shall we? I love this. I love the smell of those nuts and seeds. It's just so cool. And to have that going first thing in the morning, that's sexy. Here we go. Mmm. You know what? Sometimes breakfast can be really pedantic and boring. That, my friends, is absolutely delicious. It is gorgeous, it is sexy, and you know what? It's good for you. So try it out. So I hope you give this blueberry trifle with granola a try. It is so, so good and so good for you, especially at breakfast time, the most important meal of the day. All the ingredients are below, so check it out. I'll see you this Wednesday for another What You Want recipe, so make sure you get your requests into my Twitter, Facebook pages, or in the comments section below here on YouTube. So until then, take care.